What happened, Kalia? Bheem, a mosquito has bitten me. Now I'm scared. I'll get dengue. What should I do? Calm down, Kalia. Every mosquito is not a dengue mosquito. Dengue is mainly transmitted by the Aedes aegypti mosquito, which breeds in clean, clear, stagnant water. And do you know that this mosquito generally bites people indoors, usually at dusk or dawn? Yes, I know. And that's why my parents got fumigation done in our house yesterday. So it is safe now. Right, but not for long, Chutki. Fumigation can kill only the adult mosquitoes, not the mosquito eggs, larvae or pupae, which will fully grow in few days and may spread dengue virus. Oh, so then what should be done? Very simple, Chutki. All you have to do is make sure that water does not get accumulated in or around your house. So, you should empty the water collecting trays of your coolers, clean it and refill it with clean water at least once a week. Change water in the vases, pots, etc. on alternate days. Discard old drums, used tires and other items that collect rainwater. Always keep your water tanks, containers and dustbins covered. Keep a check on water logging and drain and clean any water reservoirs in or around your house. If you are unable to drain the water of a vessel, just ask your parents to pour a few drops of petrol or kerosene into it to prevent mosquito eggs and larvae to develop into adult mosquitoes. Cover your windows and doors with a mosquito repellent via mesh. Use mosquito repellents like sprays, coils, etc. for protection against mosquitoes. Take help from municipal authority to regularly spray insecticides in your neighborhood. But Bheem, what if after taking all these precautions, someone still gets dengue virus? How will we know? The symptoms of dengue can be easily recognized. Sudden fever, severe headache and stomach ache, severe body ache, muscle and joint pain, extreme pain in the eyes, nausea, vomiting, sweating and cold, redness and rashes on the body and the face loss of appetite, body weakness, etc. If you detect these symptoms, you should see a doctor for proper medical diagnosis immediately. So, if we have dengue, we should run to the hospital? No, Kalia. About 70% dengue fever cases can be cured just by proper consultation with the doctor and medication taken at home. However, you may need a few blood tests to monitor the platelet count. If you have less than 1 lakh platelets, you may need hospitalization. Oh, then we should take a vaccine injection or a medicine for dengue. Raju, there is no vaccine available for dengue. And if someone gets dengue fever, he or she should only use paracetamol for fever and body aches. That too, only after consulting the doctor and should strictly avoid aspirin and brufen. Also, make sure you take plenty of liquids and increase your intake of water and juices. And with proper medical care and attention, most of the affected people fully recover from dengue. So, there is nothing to worry, Kalia. All we have to do is maintain hygiene and cleanliness in our surroundings and take the necessary precautions as we discussed and we can protect ourselves and our loved ones. Please share this video with friends and family to keep them safe. Stay clean and stay safe.